Yeah, Mecca, some of this is really shocking and disgusting, so we want to warn everyone before we get into it. Now, deputies say an informant came to them on Thursday telling them that Michael Lundy asked her to arrange sex with a five-year-old. So they carried out a sting operation, pretending there would be a child available. They used a hidden camera to gather details from the suspect, including what he planned if he got his wishes. A deputy told us that Lundy even said he likes younger children because they were less affected by sexual abuse. Investigators say he practiced family law, so there is a possibility he had more victims, but they won't know until the investigation is further along. They say they're still looking at his electronics and know the suspect looked at child pornography as well. Deputies praised that informant, saying she kept her composure very well, having to pretend that the things he was saying were normal. We're told they couldn't have done it without her and that this operation took place over a four-hour span. You know, when we do uh, predator stings all the time, you know, the conversations that we have with the decoys and the, uh, the suspects, they're pretty egregious and disgusting. What makes this one even more heinous is the fact that it was a five-year-old. We've executed warrants on his personal devices, including his house, and we've recovered a bunch of electronic devices, and we're currently in the process of examining those. We're not just looking for child pornography, but other victims that he may had or other dealings that he tried to set up. Deputies say they want to hear from you if you think you know of someone who may be a victim. Now tune in tonight and we'll hear from the sheriff himself about what it means to get someone like this behind bars. <laughs>